Oh, now for a look at the weather with Sarah Keith Lucas. Hello. Hi, Sophie. It's been quite a mild and a murky sort of day out there today. We've had a lot of cloud around, but not everywhere. There were some glimpses of blue sky earlier on. The scene was taken by one of our weather watchers in Stirling. Now, as we head through the rest of this week, it is mild to start things off, but it's not going to be staying that way. Colder conditions on the way later in the week, but things will also become largely dry with a fair amount of sunshine for some of us too. But right now we've got some pretty mild air with us. You can see the yellow colours on the map. We've also got two weather fronts producing some rain, a warm front in the east, a cold front moving into the northwest. So we will continue to see rain in both the far east and also towards the northwest this evening. Now that rain in the northwest tracks its way southwards and eastwards across much of England and Wales tonight. Clearing skies for Northern Ireland and for Western Scotland, but most of us should be frost free to start off Tuesday morning. Still a lot of low cloud mist and murk around, particularly towards the east, where we'll continue to see outbreaks of rain, particularly for East Anglia and the far southeast. But actually, the rest of the country having not a bad day tomorrow. A return to sunnier skies across much of Scotland, Northern Ireland, and western parts of England and Wales, too. Whereas towards the southeast, you've got that cloud and outbreaks of rain, too. Heading through Tuesday evening and overnight, eventually we'll lose all the cloud and the rain from southern and eastern England. And sky's clear, so things turning a little bit colder on into the early hours of Wednesday morning. We'll certainly see a frost for Scotland and for Northern Ireland. England and Wales likely to see some mist and some fog. So not a day of sparkling sunshine, but it's looking mostly dry. Some sunny spells, but again there'll be some mist, fog and low cloud, particularly across England and Wales. And temperatures not as mild as they have been. So we're back into single figures by the time we get to Wednesday. Wednesday. That's a sign of things to come. As high pressure builds across Scandinavia, we're going to be seeing colder easterly winds. And Sophie, they could bring perhaps the odd snow shower as we head to the end of the week. More snow. Sarah, thank you.